The imprisonment of as many as one million Uyghurs in Western China was a major news story in 2019. An investigation by John Sudworth of the BBC helped establish the extent of the human rights violations of the Muslim people. From satellite photographs, he showed the systematic demolition of Uyghur neighborhoods and mosques. He recounted tales of abuse from refugees abroad, and he put the lie to a tour he was given of one facility that was sanitized to look like a harmless school for Chinese culture. For his intrepid investigation, John Sudworth has won the Television Reporting Award. One of the insights that my work on Xinjiang has given me is this. We sometimes make the mistake, I think, of assuming that the abuses of the authoritarian regimes of the past would have been obvious to us had we lived through them. This simply isn't true, of course. Germany in the 1930s had plenty of admirers, many of them powerful and influential. The Soviet Union had its fellow travellers and China today is no different. The point of journalism, of course, in any society is to dig, is to look for the hidden truths. And what I've learned is that in authoritarian societies, you just need to dig that much harder. So I've been extremely lucky to have had the support of an amazing team dedicated to doing just that, to uncovering the certainties on a story that China works very, very hard to hide. Over the past few years, I've spoken to some of those from Xinjiang who have had their lives torn apart. Parents who may never see their children again, children who don't know where the rest of their family are. And telling those stories has been humbling, but it is also fraught with risk, not just for those who choose to speak to us, but for some of those involved in the reporting as well. And so I dedicate this award to each and every one of them.